Hello everybody. Welcome back to my channel. My name is Chantrice. Um, so I just want to apologize for it being a month before this video here. Um, Happy New Year, everybody. Um, so oh, Happy New this Year. is my fiance. Uh, so um, I was dealing with a lot of mental health issues last month. So I really wasn't capable of doing anything. Um, I recently lost my job because of my mental health issues, but I'm currently looking for one. So don't you guys worry. Um, we have a wedding. So of course, mama needs a job. Um, this video is going to be me sharing with you and Adam, sharing with you our New Year's resolutions for 2020. Um, so if you like what you hear in my video, please like, subscribe, hit that bell for notifications. You do you. I mean, just give me a thumbs up on the channel. Comment, share. Anything helps because it shows me love. It shows that you guys actually care to watch my channel, although the lighting sucks in this house. Um, we're like above our little lamp or oh, under our lamp here uh so i i wrote down 10 but then i put like an extra one on my list so this is my list here of everything that i've written down for you guys today and so um adam you want to go first with your new year's resolutions sure why not i want a six pack i want to get in shape i want a six pack too I want to work on myself and uh, and on becoming a better person and on socializing a little bit more, um, getting into contact with my family more often, um, meditating more, you know, eating more veggies and stuff, just uh, being at peace with myself. I'm trying to get like the right angle from my face because it's like... Look up and then like just kind of, that's going to be like the best way for right now. Dead pose. <laughs> okay. All right. So my New Year's resolutions are, are going to be, <laughs> it's like tickling me. Keep going. It's going to be for number one, um, I've recently started a vegan lifestyle. So... There were times where I would have slip-ups while doing a vegan lifestyle, but my goal for 2020 and for the rest of my life is to be completely vegan. Like, no slip-ups, like, no milk, no butter, except for, like, almond milk or vegan butter. Or you almond know? butter. Almond butter is good. I have almond butter. It's good stuff. I like peanut butter. Peanut butter? I'm actually going to make some peanut butter. Um, I... I but let's not get distracted here. <laughs> so um, the second one that I have is to be more confident. Um, I was never confident, like growing up in all of my 27 years of life. I know what kind of newborn is not going to be confident in herself. But when you have, I'm not going to really say any names, but just like um, throughout my childhood, you know, I was called ugly. I was called like bitch, slut, like a tramp dog, like I was called like everything in the book and you know and that really like brought my low um, self-esteem down to the point where I was doing like self-harm to myself throughout high school like um, like whenever I came home I would just lock myself in a room because I didn't want to I didn't want to go through that anymore so um, so it was just a lot so I'm hoping to be more confident and to be able to show off like my body and be like more confident in my body. Uh, number three, this is something that Adam and I both have agreed on. Before I made this list was a no spending challenge. And I'm going to show you guys my little grid I made here in this book. This is like my everything book, so... No spend challenge right here. And it's like basically um, going cold turkey with 
how I spend my money now because I recently was told that I spend a lot of money on stuff that is not important. But I, <laughs> I saw that. But I have decided to go cold turkey, and my goal is to at least have thirty five hundred in my account. Me, PS Four. Is that? Yeah, we were watching like this show called Three Below on Netflix. This is not sponsored, but I just want to let y'all know that's a very good show. Um, we were watching a lot of good stuff. <laughs> Yeah, so um, part of the no spend challenge is that like we don't go out to eat. Uh, we pack our lunches and we like for me especially I have to stay out of the makeup stores because I freaking love Ulta. Um, like the reward that I decided to give myself was um, Florida in July because we're getting married in July. And uh, we're thinking about like going to Disney. Yep. And Universal Studios. Yeah, for our Universal honeymoon. Studios. So just Florida. Um, and then a happy husband and also some form of financial freedom. Uh, so yeah. So like the exception with where I can spend my money is like rent, utilities, phone bill, food. And then like if I need clothes, basically, you know, I wear them until they basically rip you know i'm thick so you know thick thighs you know rip rip jeans and like in the thigh area so which is like mm, kind of developing a little hole right now uh number four is to cook more at home and meal prep um <laughs> funny story today i thought that there were classes but there wasn't classes so i was sitting at the school school was pretty empty but just for like school you know i plan on meal prepping um, you know, food, not only for me, but for him, because like he works, um, seven to three thirty every day. So, you know, I want to, I want him to have like a nice meal when he's at work. Um, and for me to just cook more at home, like, you know, I know what I'm putting into my body. I know what kind of spices I'm using. I know like what I'm eating. So, and, uh, it helps me because I'm actually working on a small, like, you know, little recipe book for myself so that when it, you know, when I am finished, I can actually post a few um, videos here, uh, like showing you guys what I make once I find editing software. I know I keep saying I'm going to get editing software. I'm going to get it. I would just have to buy a new computer. That's the only thing, but I am looking for one second hand. Uh, number five, would be to walk and to read more. So before I go to bed at night, I want to try to at least read a chapter. I'm actually reading Dear John by Nicholas Sparks. So uh, I'm going to read one chapter. I'm going to finish up chapter two and half of chapter three tonight. And uh, to walk because, you know, upon like being a vegan, I you know, know that I have to exercise a lot more. And my goal is to at least walk 30 minutes a day and to listen to a podcast, like, while I do so. So, like, you know, I can have, like, my 30 minutes of, what you call it, like, activity. You know, like, how they say, you know, like, 30 minutes to an hour for, like, stuff uh, for your body, like, of activity to, like, keep your heart rate going. <laughs> Glen Coco. Sorry, my cat just gave me the weirdest look ever. <laughs> She's uh, trying to eat the bowl that's on her yeah. collar. Um, number six is to focus on being more mellow. Now, I have a low tolerance for ignorance. Mm -hmm. Adam knows. I do not mess with childish people. So if I see something and like, cause he knows I pop off really easily and I'm just like, what the fuck? Ah! Like I just start yelling I'm and he's like, extreme. no, not that extreme, but you know how I get like, if there's like a jack hole in the car and he's trying to like cut you off, like, yeah, like we'll be driving, well, I'll be driving and she'll be in the passenger seat and someone will not use their signal or pull ahead of me too soon and I, I know what's going on you know like I, I know when to stop and you know 
when to slow down or when to speed up to change lanes. And she's over here. What the fuck is your problem? And, you know, I like nice turning off. signal asshole. Yeah, but exactly. anywho, uh, number seven they is can't hear you. <laughs> true. But number seven is to be a good wife. Now, I know that there's no perfect definition of a good wife, but I want to make him the happiest man ever to where like, I know that we will fight. I know that we will have our disagreements where of course I win all the time, but Mm -hmm. I just want to (laughs) be, I just, you know, I just want to be a good wife for him. Like I want to, you know, make sure that like after he comes home from work, like he has a nice meal on the table and, you know, and of course like, you know, we'll be having 20 kids. So, you know, I have to make sure that <laughs> I have to make sure that, you know, he's not tired. <laughs> uh, number eight is to make cooking videos. As mentioned before, with the cook more at home. Um, yeah, so I, I do want to make more cooking videos. Uh, number nine is to declutter stuff I don't use anymore. I'm a part of this Facebook group where it's like a buy nothing. I just got this armoire, brand freaking new, for free. Like that was the house. from Pier One. Yeah, We're I couldn't even lift it. I licked my back, and I think I really busted my knee. I think something happened to my lower back. Mm-hmm. Yeah, so like, like it's hard because I feel like if I twist my knee a certain way, it's gonna like I feel like it's just gonna crack. Cause like it's like I could feel it, but <laughs> anywho, <laughs> going on to number ten is to get enough sleep. Lord, <laughs> let me tell y'all, I go to bed at like two thirty, three o'clock in the morning because I am constantly watching like stuff on my hulu or watching youtube videos she falls asleep with the headphones on and i have to take them off of her in the morning i do (laughs) guilty guilty very much guilty so my goal like i said is to read a chapter before going to bed so i can get in the zone okay i can fall asleep most likely tonight i'm gonna be up around the same time too and for number 11 one one That is 11. That is 11. It's also pause. Yeah, it is also pause. <laughs> is to... My my thing is, I want to try to collab with other YouTubers. Um, I've been speaking to one girl who's also new to YouTube, and her and I are trying to figure out how to collab with each other. Maybe, you know, I'll share her links um, like when the time comes. Um, I will be collabing with her. Her name is Liz, and we've been in contact. Um, and she's she's so like she seems so sweet. Um, so yeah, my goal is to try to connect with other YouTubers, and um, you know also share more with you guys to um, give you the content that you guys deserve. Uh, school does start next week, so I might be a little bit busy because, you know, I have, like, one class that has a lab, and that class, like, really needs to be focused on, um, a lot more, so, yeah, um, one thing I wanted to ask you guys is, um, I'm thinking about starting a Patreon for my channel, so if you guys are interested in that, like, leave a comment on my channel, um, I have to figure out like how to set it up so that, you know, maybe for those who do pay for it, like they can see the videos early. It's something like that. Like I have to do my research, but you know. Anyone that does, I'll make origami stuff for you. Oh, that'll be nice. Little origami uh, tree ornaments or origami like little turtles. I can, I can do those things. Yeah. So I'm not here to like ask for money. If that's what you guys are thinking, that's not what I'm here to do. I'm just going to try to set up a Patreon and it's completely up to you if you guys want to do that. Um, but like I said, I'd appreciate it. Um, if I do like set up the Patreon. So do you have anything else you want to add? 
I can look up other origami stuff. <laughs> I used to do it in high school. It's kind of a little fun. It's something me and her can be able to do together. Which is actually something we were talking about is doing uh, little origami turtles or something and then like leaving it in the storage, you know, just like randomly for people to find. Yeah, like today in Trader Joe's, because we just went shopping, mm-hmm. oh my gosh, a food haul video. Mm, I don't know about that. We're going to do a food haul video one day next time I go grocery shopping, and I'm going to show you guys what I got. Hmm. Well, I thought you meant like while we're at the store. I mean, there's this whole like shop with me, and then food haul thing, but but like basically what I saw is that like you know i've been watching like some youtubers such as like uh, madeline olivia and um who else did i see i think that was just it but like but but she's from the uk though and uh and she's was like you know she would shop at aldi see some stuff but then she'll bring it home like she doesn't completely show everything she got until like towards like after she gets home and everything but yeah that's something you know i'm interested in doing i have to write that down in my new 2020 binder um so yeah yeah i do appreciate you guys watching my video again i do apologize about this video being so late um i know it's been like a month i know it's been a while um i've been really trying to like pull myself together again if you like the video please like subscribe Hit the bell for notifications, comment, give me a thumbs up, show me some love. Um, I'll also be putting all my social media links down in the description box so that you can follow me on Instagram. I mean, I'm always looking for new friends. Hell, add me on Facebook. I'll, you know, put my name down there too. Um, and then I don't have a Twitter. <laughs> I suck. Um, but, you know, I don't have a Twitter. I never had a Twitter. I, I haven't really had a Twitter in so Twitter long. Or Facebook or any of that, to be um, and also, if you're looking to do some collaborations with me, I'll also be putting my email down below too. So yeah, that's it for tonight, guys. I hope you guys are having a wonderful new year already. And love. <laughs> Bye. <laughs> Oh my gosh. Ah, bye.